I saw a post recently of some people having trouble soldering header pins onto their devices, and many of these boards tend to come without the pins installed at a slightly cheaper price. And it's really easy to do, so I figured I'd make a quick video and show you how I do it. Some people like to press the header pins down into a breadboard first and then put their chip on top, whatever direction they want to solder them in. But I find that most of these boards, like a Raspberry Pi being a header pins only at the top, you have to shove something underneath to keep it stable, otherwise your pins come out a little crooked and cockeyed. So what I do is place the pins in, and then I use a little alligator clip and just grab it right in the middle. That securely holds the pins in, keeps them flat against the surface, and it makes it really easy to then just flip it the other way around and solder down the rows. Do the same thing with my new favorite Place the pins in. If you prefer to solder them top side, it's the same, same deal. Get your pins in there, and then just an alligator clip grabbing the backside plastic and the top of the board. Once you get a few pins soldered in place, I start from the, the two opposite ends then the rest kind of holds itself. One of the reasons I don't like to press it down into a breadboard is when you're doing so, sometimes the resistance of that breadboard will start to actually shift the plastic holder pushing your pins up. And that's what I saw in some of the posts is uh, people's pins were coming out a little crazy where you get an effect like this because they pressed it into the breadboard. And doing it with an alligator clip is not only pretty quick, but it prevents that from happening. So there we go, a pretty quick, easy way to keep your pins straight and level while you solder them in place onto your boards. It works for pretty much every board type out there. So now it's time to go use these in our next project. Thanks for watching. <laughs>